Hello out there and welcome to English 2 Plays. We're here with Boat Rage, which is a new game. It's on Steam and we're going to play. Hold up. I'm loving this sort of uh, synthwave 80s vibe. Um, I guess we're going to go for an adventure or... Oh, I don't... Okay. So, we're wazding. And I guess we get we gain time by going through the, uh... The checkpoints. Okay. Oh, those are mines, I suppose. A little time. Nice. Ooh. So I don't know. Lap three out of one. I don't. Oh, geez. The visuals certainly are interesting. Oh. I think it crashed. Oh, no. It didn't crash. It just. It froze for a second for whatever reason. Oh. Oh, we managed to make it outside of the, uh. The, the barriers, cool. Oh. So I don't know how we're lap three of one. That's just weird. And we're gonna run out of time. Oh no, no, we'll get there. Nice, so we got more time. So we're getting random sound effects happening as well. Okay. I mean, so we are going to run out of time very shortly. That's fine. I don't, I don't know if there's more to it than that. Oh. Oh, we made it. We made it to the next one. Okay. We're still lap three of one. And now, and now we will run out of time. I feel like the timer goes a lot slower than what I would expect. But that's fine. That means that we've survived longer than we should have. Mm, yeah. I mean, there's no pickups or anything. We're just driving along. All right. Oh, nearly. Oh, we made Right. Okay. So we're still going, team. We're still going. There's been no change in the scenery and in uh, any of the uh, gameplay at all. It's just boating around. Oh, we made up a second there. Okay. Oh. So now we're lap three of two. So that was the... We, we just completed the first lap. Okay. Right. So we are unlikely to make it to the next lap. Oh no, no. Man, we're still... We're still going. I, I'm not I still, I'm not sure what the mines do. I think the mines take time away from you. Not that the game explained any of that. Um, Alright, so we've made up some time. I thought we were going to lose, but we've managed to make up some time. So we might even win. I mean, I doubt it. Um, what I might do is... I don't know, because it's just its just the same thing over and over. I kind of like the... I kind of like the... Oop! I like the, the look of it and stuff. And I kind of like the way that the boat drives. I'm, I'm just holding out for when we're going to die. I was going to i was gonna say I'll fast forward it, but... This is it. Oh no, we didn't quite die. I thought we were going to die, but we didn't. We just barely survived. Man, the, the seconds are very long on this game. Yeah. I mean... It's fine, 
Right. Race lose. Right, so it just starts over. Oh, I don't I don't know what's going on there. Okay. So it's it started over. The game started over. There's no other No other buttons or anything. I'm trying to hit one of these mines. I just wanted to see what they do. Oh they go they go flying and they slow you down. Right. Of course. That's cool. I like the way that the numbers spin and everything. It's pretty fun. Okay, but there's no I don't I don't know why that's so big. I don't know why that screen's so big. Uh, yeah, I can't I can't see it or anything. Okay, well we'll just force quit it, I suppose. And um Maybe we'll just go look at the description now and see what the game has to say for itself. All right, Boat Rage, 3D racing game on boats. You drive a boat, dodging mines, crossing checkpoints in time, get to the finish line in time. Uh, developed by Taser Studio and published on the 3rd of December. It doesn't look like, just looking at it from, you know, this, this trailer here, it doesn't look like there's any other content. You know, we've, I think we might have experienced the content that there is and that's fine it currently costs seven dollars 95 so for this sort of game i would expect to pay 99 cents or maybe less than that but i think the lowest you can have it on steam is 99 cents new zealand um 49 cents us or something like that that's the price i would expect to pay for this because there's really nothing in it um it's got some cool like midi it's got a cool midi track it's got um, some interesting sort of screen mechanics and stuff, but there's nothing else there. Um, so, uh, you know, some people gave me some flack uh, two days ago because I played that um, To the Earth game, which was, you know, about driving to the Earth. And there wasn't much in that, but at least the concept was interesting, you know, driving from Mars down to Earth. Uh, this is just a boat and some water, and you go through very samey looking envi environments, you know. Um, to the Earth had, you know, planets and space and stars and bright colors and all sorts of stuff going on visually uh, that allowed it to be interesting. This is, it doesn't have any of that. Uh, and it costs, you know, way more. <laughs> it is far more expensive than uh, To the Earth was. So, yeah, if it were, if it were... 50 cents or a dollar then i might be like okay sure but it's not it's uh seven dollars 95 on special down from 13.25 it needs to be way cheaper um boat races are arranged you are the only remaining participant who got into an awkward situation mines begin to emerge from the water which you need to go around and arrive at the finish line in time because mines are not an excuse boat rates 3d racing game on boats you drive a boat dodging mines crossing checkpoints in time get to the finish line in time Game features 3D, visual style, dynamic music, difficulty. Uh, yeah, sure. And they've got this game. Oh, and they also released a game called Water Chaos, which looks like a platformer in water. And then they're planning on releasing another little platformer style thing. Oh, Tower Defense um, in quarter four of 2022. I mean, nothing wrong with making little tiny games and releasing them once they're ready to rock, uh, but you gotta price them appropriately, yeah? So this needs to be a dollar if you want people to try it, or even free to play, you know, with like, I don't know, cosmetic skins and stuff, but my guess is there's not a lot of coding here, there's not a lot of coding behind this. I do like it, kind of. I wish there were more things happening. You know, I wish there was just, you know, there's more, I wish there were more layers, more content. Um, yeah, I don't have a lot of extra stuff to say about Boat Rage. It exists. If you want to check it out, you can uh, click on the link in the description 
and check it out on Steam. Otherwise, leave me a comment down below, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys next time. Class dismissed.